come from? Dad, check this out! What happened? Look, my tooth came out! Wow, let me see. That was a new windshield. For what will be a lengthy and impressive meteor shower, according to Ross Cosmos, oh, well. there's a chance to see Dad, a meteor shower. Dad, are we going to the... Igor, put your tongue into the hole where your tooth was. Uh, are we going to watch the meteor shower tomorrow evening? Yeah, sure. Please, buckle your seatbelt. It is, for sure. Lying on your back and looking... Do you have transparent nail polish scrolls? Why? To prevent the crack from spreading further. Meteor showers have Life hack. Life hack. ...passes through the debris field of a comet or asteroid as these objects make their way around the sun. Shedding crumbs along the way. According That's to pretty science, bad. Also, well, because when they say there's no danger, that implies it will definitely hit us. <laughs> it's a joke. <laughs> I was just kidding. Get ready, Vladivostok. The encounter with the miracle will occur in exactly 24 hours. And so again, don't forget to make a wish. Too early. I already told you the candles will burn down, you idiot. And just one more toast, okay? Thank you very much. I want to tell you something. For the past year, my happiness has doubled. And why is that? I used to have one child, Yegor. And after I married Svetlana, now we have two kids. Yegor and Valeria. But you can never be too happy. As you know, we're having a baby. <laughs> and I want to make a toast to my my son's eighth birthday. Yegor, cheers to you. Happy birthday, Yegor. Thanks. Happy birthday. Cheers. The cake. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. It's okay, I'll get her. Stay put. Yeah. <laughs> Keep going. <laughs> yeah. uh, we all know what this is. Puberty, right? <laughs> Lyra? Lyra, wait. Lyra! Do I have to chase you? What's going on? Could you please avoid making a scene at your little brother's birthday party? Mommy's not my brother. Sure, they aren't your brother or father. <laughs> I'm your mother, though. Hmm? Your phone is ringing. It's your father. What the hell does he want? It's a bad time, Arabov. Hey, I wanted to talk about Lyra. What Lyra? Oh, that, Lyra, your daughter. Uh -huh. Listen, I think she's relapsed. Someone set off a flare at the stadium, and she almost fainted. Did you see that? Uh-huh. I think we have to do something about it now before it's too late. Sveta, we must accept that our girl has special needs. Well, Lyra, shut up. <sighs> so I'm just a problem? Yeah, Mom? No. I have special needs, Lyra, Mom? No, he didn't mean that. Don't bother. Lyra! Why didn't you tell me she could hear us? Lyra! Jesus Christ. That's just great. Flight engineer Araba, your pulse rate is extremely high. Mira, play our track. Let's do some breathing exercises first. I'll pass, sorry. All right then. Playing our track. Hello. Dude, I told you. Chill out, there's nothing wrong. Nothing wrong, really? You should have dinner in 30 minutes. Hmm, I'm sorry. Hope they enjoy their meal. Hey, check the bank. Cool. Peter Sergovich. The man I was looking for. Hi, Valera. So how went the testing? It went nominally. All systems are green. Were stadium cameras part of the testing as well? <sighs> oh, 
something's wrong with your daughter. Peter Sergovich. I cleaned it up. Valera, even if you cleaned it up on our end, you can't hide the inbound traffic. I get it. Orbiting for six years, you miss your family. But you put us at risk. We don't know what can happen. Just stop doing it. There are no fools, understand? Officially, we don't have this equipment. Take a look. We're studying butterflies. You know damn well they can court-martial us. They're waiting for you at home. Think about that. No one is waiting for me. My bad, Peter Sergovich. It won't happen again. Commander Antonov, MCC is calling for you. No, nothing's changed. The asteroid will be over the Pacific tomorrow at precisely 8.19 a.m. As expected, a cluster of fragments will follow. They don't pose a threat, right? No, the asteroid definitely doesn't. Um, fragments, according to our sensors, aren't a threat for the Earth either, only if... Thanks, Sergeyevich. Valera, hi. How's it going? Hi. Fine, Alex Obovich. Yeah, we're approaching the cluster. We've been tracking it. It's going well. We actually have a lot of leeway. So far, so good, sir. Yeah, well, not to be negative, only if our sensors are correct. Antonov, elaborate. Come on, Gina. Uh, thing is, sir, the asteroid's likely to have organic compounds, such as carbons, for example, and the examination of certain of its um, components might not be possible. They could move in a different trajectory. What are the odds of that happening? The odds are the same, but... But look at this, sir. The cluster doesn't look typical. You see? If we assume that these sensors are approximative or plain wrong, the fragments will definitely move along a different trajectory, and therefore they will directly pass over the Pacific Ocean. Get to the point, if you don't mind. I don't mind. I suggest we evacuate Primorsky Krai and Khabarovsk Krai. Well, I'd suggest we evacuate the Mogadon region as well. You know, just in case. Commander Antonov, I'd like to know if you can give me a coherent answer about the composition of the cluster. You can't give a coherent answer now. Alex Elbovich will give you a definitive answer as soon as possible. What are the chances that the cluster consists of, of this unknown substance? Give me something. The chances are quite minimal. What do you mean, minimal? I mean, they're very slim, sir. So there's no chance? Well, yeah. That's great news. But theoretically speaking... Theoretically? Wh what are you implying? Is there a chance that our planet can fall out or, or be knocked out of its orbit someday? In theory, yes. What are you saying? Uh, yes, there is, sir. Then if we were to act theoretically, perhaps we should evacuate the whole planet. Why think small, huh? you can because you can see all that beauty from the ground you know <laughs> he's right i know one place let's go come on a 
Margova? Start late tomorrow. A girl, some cutlets. You want some? No. <sighs> Yegor! <sighs> I thought we agreed that you wouldn't go to my side of the bedroom, like, ever. I'm sorry. I thought you'd like a piece of cake. So, are you going to watch the meteor shower tomorrow? No, I can't. Dad has to go to work and I'll go to school. Mom, well, don't be too upset. What about the wish? Mmm, it's just a fairy tale. I tried it many times. Mmm, never works. Exactly, because you couldn't make the wishes in time. Behind it. Okay, a star falls really fast, right? Sure. Lara, I know for a fact that you have to make a wish while it's falling, but that's almost impossible. That's why I wanted to get it on video so that I could make a lot of wishes. I will let you make some, too. That's a great plan. You should do it tomorrow. I would, but I can't see it from the city. the construction site? Yeah. I was there today. There's a hole in the fence so we can access it. From the roof you can spy the comet. You'll have the best view possible. Cool. Mm -hmm. I didn't tell you that though. Mm. That's it, go. Get out of my half. Yeah. <sighs> Great. Mark number 23. Let's say you're thirsty. Find a birch tree, try not to dirty your sneakers. Get an orange. And just squeeze it in your mouth like that.
Now go higher. Why? Because then you'll be too far and I'll need a telescope. Because then you'll be too far and I'll need a telescope. Where did you get this from? When you watch this video, your heart rate slows considerably. Go back here. I recommend you to watch it regularly as a preventative measure. You're speaking to me as if I have a chronic sickness. Absolutely not. You're in great shape for a man your age. Your compliments really warm the... my heart. Overheating of the heart muscles results directly to a heart attack. That's it. Go to sleep. Good morning, Vladivostok. Although it appears to be a typical Monday, it isn't. Primarai residents will soon be able to witness a one-of-a-kind beauty event. A massive asteroid from the Gita constellation will pass in close proximity to Earth in exactly 45 minutes. Don't miss it. Deviation from the tracking trend. There's actually no deviation, Antonov. Great. All the ground services remain on high alert. Waiting for contact. Valera, change by three points the focal length. Done, switching to infrared mode. What's on the spectrograph? The spectrograph is fine, nothing to report. The object approaching exosphere. Perigee point is in 42 minutes and 50 seconds. At 8.18 a.m., a giant asteroid will fly at the minimum distance from our planet. After, it will retreat into the depths of space. Those who are sensitive to climate change may feel a slight malaise. Early reports indicated that the asteroids were quite small in size, but grew larger as the storm continued. Small meteorites and cosmic dust will partially come into contact with the Earth's atmosphere. Burning debris forms a phenomenon known to us as a meteor shower. Son. Have a great day, Igor. Bye, Dad. You should have gone to see the comet with him. He'd just have missed one day at school. It's the first day of the school year. It's more important. But we'll see these stars some other time. Perigee and is now at a distance from Earth. You may bid farewell to our rock star. Everyone did a good job. Congratulations. Keep up the good work. <laughs> Let's remain on the alert for the time being. Say well hello to our asteroids well cheer squad. Valera, zoom in on the 14th center. Turn the brightness down. What the hell is going on? Why is the cluster crossing the moon? On this side. Because it's wider than we expected. Much wider. Okay.
adjust the diameter of the asteroid group, according to the new data. Mira. Analysis. The asteroid group's trajectory crosses that of the station. It is recommended to start the elusive maneuver. What's going on? What's the situation? What the hell is happening? That's an overboard. What? Cluster approach time to the station. Seven minutes, 35 seconds. Fine. Go ahead and get ready to maneuver. Roger. Old solar panel. Yes. We won't make it. Prepare engines. On it. We must make it. The station is too heavy. Can we undock the transport module? Go ahead. Size the asteroid group's fragments. What's the damage area? The damage area includes Australia, New Zealand, Okinawa, Kagoshima, Promorsky Krai, South Korea. Details on Promorsky Krai. Putting the data on the screen. Mira, call Lyra now. Get a hold of her by any means possible. Are you insane? Lyra, look out the window. What? Look out the window. What is that? Run. Prepare for impact.
boy, listen. Please cover your face. Stick together. Together, okay? Zero, oh. move! Tanya? Tanya? What do we do? How did this happen? Let me go check on her. Wait. Wait. We can't leave her here. We need to get her in the car. Hold on, honey. You know that I can't lift more than one pound. Hey, young man. Please, sir. Young come man, on, come sir. here. You have to help us. Please, you help us carry her to my car. Girl, come on. I ran over her. She needs to go to the hospital. Help. Here. Thank you. Thanks for your help. Thank you. Thank you. Come on. Come on, Musa. Come on. Help her out, Musa. Come on. Heal the girl. Slow down. Slow down. Close your eyes if you're scared, okay? For Christ's sake. I can't see without my glasses anyway. You have them. Put them on your nose. What have I done to deserve this, huh? These are my reading glasses. Uh, you still can't tell the difference? Why do you always have to take my glasses, Roma, huh? Stop uh, it. This has nothing to uh, do with me. You're always losing your stuff, and it's Roma's fault. Yeah. Roma. Last time I looked for them, I found them in the fridge. How did they end up there, huh? Jesus. Ah! She's a healer. She saved your life. She'll stomp on you for a little bit, and then, you know, all of a sudden, you're fine. Like magic, right? You know? Right, Roma? That's right! Ah!
What about the others? Is anyone wounded? Other areas of the station are depressurized. Uh, Only one crew member survived. Who? You, Flight Engineer Alibov. We're losing connection. Where is everyone? Why can't I get through? Can you Transferring station and crew report to Mission Control Center. How is Earth, Mira? How's Lyra? Collecting information from available sources. Mira, reboot the central console. Turn on emergency lights. <laughs> A summary report on the meteor impact on Earth has been completed. The total impact area exceeded 6 million square miles. It spread from Australia to the Far East, China's coastal territory. Most of Japan and the New Zealand territories were affected by the waves caused by the fall of the meteor. Vladivostok. The city is experiencing significant destruction. Rescue work is carried out by the Federal Rescue Service. Ruski Island is being evacuated. A hospital has been established on the campus. What about my family? The location of Svetlana's cell phone was determined to be the temporary hospital's grounds. And Lyra? Flight Engineer Arabov, Mission Control Center, is calling. Yeah. Answer it. Lyra, you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Straight to the point. Station is beyond saving. I understand. Start making preparations for evacuation. Got it? Yeah, copy that. In the current situation, we can't use the station's energy to communicate with Earth. It's the last time we speak. Now, Mira is in charge of the entire evacuation program. Blair, you only have one task. Just to listen to her. That's it. Copy that. Starting the preparations now. Over and out. Mira, what's the time frame? The station will enter the atmosphere in 3 hours, 14 minutes, and 15 seconds. Mira, what's the search system status? Search system is functioning. Activate the system. Direct it at Vladivostok. Determine the last known location of Lyra's phone. And check CCTV databases. The use of the search system will cause the backup batteries to deplete more quickly. I don't care. Find her, Mira. Just find her. Okay. Okay, let's go. 
It's just, let's sing our song together, okay? I'll start, honey. I still don't know where I am. Come on, come on, flying. No, Lyra, that won't do. We have to sing together, loud and proud. Come on, don't be scared. To the place where they were loved. To the place where they all forgot to wait for the ones that they love. Right there. up your phone signal, but it's broken. So I connected to another device. Are you, are you okay? Sweetheart? <laughs> can you or not? Yeah. I can move. Sweetheart, yeah. Yeah. It's a baby monitor. It's got a built-in camera and a microphone. Can you see me? Uh-huh. Hello, sweetheart. What's with the city? Where's mom? Your mom is okay, don't worry. She's on the island with Boris. There's almost no damage over there. And Yegor? How's Yegor, Dad? I'm sorry, I don't have the information yet. So are you at my apartment? <sighs> Lyra, the city was badly damaged. And our... I mean, your home is no longer standing. How... How did you allow this to happen? You were you were supposed to do something. You could have done something to prevent this. Lyra, Why didn't calm you, down, Dad? Why didn't you? Calm down and listen to me. You miraculously survived. What? Now you need to get out. Mirror is scanning the building as we speak, all right? You need to check the inside. I will match the signals, and I will find the weakest spot. You got it? I do, yeah. <laughs> Mira, connect to video stream. Start scouring the selected area. What should I do, Dad? In the toy store, northern wing of the building. Can you see me? Give me your hand. Come on, give me your hand. Be careful. That's it. Hey, can you walk? Okay, let's go. Can you hear me? I can hear you. Be careful. <laughs> What's your name? Lyra. <laughs> Lyra, are you hurt? You hear me? Are you wounded? No, I'm fine. Look, there's a camp on the embankment. Everyone will be evacuated from there. I want you to go there, okay? You got it? Thirsty? Here, go 
there, go! You can't stay here, it's too dangerous. You have to go, Lyra, run! <sighs> That's me. Are you okay? Yeah, how's Lyra? You know where she is? Yeah, I'll push it through. <gasps> Lyra. Mama's on the line. Lyra? Lyra! Mama. Oh, thank God. I was so worried. Mom, I'm okay. It's fine. How are you? We're at the university library. They set up a hospital here. The bridge is broken. I can't come and get... Mom, 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 stop it. It's help. fine. Arabov is helping me. Where's Yegor? Uh, it's Lyra. She's okay. Yegor's fine, too. They're bringing the whole school here. Lyra, did you hear that? Yegor's fine. Now, please, listen to your father. Mom? Is Yegor on the list? I don't know. They didn't give me the list. Listen, everything depends on you now. Promise me you'll get her here. Safe and sound, okay? Promise. Yeah, Sveta, I promise. I'll keep an eye on her. Okay, over and out. I messed up. Okay, Lyra. There's a camp on the embankment. Everyone, over here! You have to go there. He's not there. Who? Igor didn't go to school today. He went to watch the meteor show. What? Where did he go? There. Mira, detailed analysis on that building. Lyra, how do you know he's there? I... I know because I sent him there. The building structure is in critical condition. The probability of collapse is 87%. Jesus Christ. I'll deal with it. Mira will scan the building to see if he's there. Then I'll give his exact coordinates to the rescue team, okay? Lyra? Where are you going? There's no one over there. Lyra. It's very dangerous. Don't go there. Lyra. Lyra, come back. Come on, people. Lyra. Lyra? Damn it, Mira, what's with the signal? Call Lyra now. Search system deactivated. Station is put into hibernation mode. Mira, talk to me. What just happened? Engineering areas rechargeable batteries are out. Flight engineer Arabov, the station will enter the atmosphere in 2 hours 22 minutes. You need to evacuate immediately. Mira, where the hell is the battery backup? Okay, great. Connect to the laboratory's battery. Connection is impossible. Why? Disruption of the communication between areas. But we can restore the connection. I just have to go to the other side. Currently, the spacewalk is highly undesirable. Please, proceed to the escape pod. Mira, do you understand what I'm saying or not? Get ready for the spacewalk. I'm not letting her down.
Yegor? as well as 148 more languages and dialects. It was once again a rhetorical question, Mira. When will you finally understand that? Yegor! Mira! Yegor, I'm coming! Hold tight! Mira... Distance from the laboratory compartment? The distance is 60 feet. It should be enough then. Cable length accordance to the estimated distance confirmed. There you go. Now there's just one thing left to do. Detected. 
Lyra's inside the building. What? Probability of collapse. Put me in touch with her now. I'm on my way back. Come on, come on. Right here. Connection established. Lyra. Lyra. Arabov, where have you been? Why don't you listen to me, huh? I told you to go to the camp, not to that building. You can't stay in there. I found him! What? I found Yegor. Oh, my God. Well done, sweetheart. Everything around us is collapsing. I don't know how to get out. Can, can you help us? Lyra, go hide somewhere. I just need 20 seconds. Let's go there. Get up! Arabov is connected to it. He can connect anything. Can he help us? Of course he can help us. And he will. Lyra. Lyra. Yeah? You have to run inside the building. That's the only way. You have to go to the meteorite breach. Yegor, I know where it is. Run here. Come on. Come on. Well done. You're almost there. Look out! That's it, go down there. Vera, I'm not going there. I'm scared. Okay, don't look down. Just just look at me, okay? Look at me, look at me. All right. All right. I'll figure it out. Don't worry. I'll come up with something. I'll come up with something. What is it, Lyra? Get down there quickly. Yeah, go It's gonna be all right. You and I are gonna play a game, okay? We'll both be monkeys. How does that sound? Okay, climb on my back and hold tight, all right? As if you were a backpack. Don't let go of me. Hold tight. Come on, you can do this. I am detecting an imminent threat. Hold on! Lyra! Lyra! Oh my God. Mira, what the hell happened? Connection interrupted. Okay, okay. Can you detect them? Can you see anything? Report to me. What's going on there? Building sustainability is damaged. Collapse probability is 99%. Mira, can you do anything? Yes. I can prepare an emergency escape capsule as soon as the decompression is finished. Please, try to relax. Watch the video designated as calming. I said, turn it off. All right. To save power, I will momentarily turn off any untapped devices. No. There are seven minutes, no. 40 seconds left no. until decompression no. is finished.
Couldn't do it. Sorry. Couldn't do what? When the star was falling from the sky, I got very scared and chickened out. Because of that, we won't be able to make our wish, Lyra. Oh, your cheek is swollen. Don't be afraid. It'll soon pass. And about the star? No one can stop you from making a wish. You just don't wait for some star to make it come true. Do you see what happens when the stars fall? But didn't you believe in miracles when you were a child? I was eight years old, uh, just like you now. We moved to the new house. Mom had gone to the store. Um, while me and Arabov were bringing in our stuff by the elevator. I was fooling around and got stuck in the elevator. When Arabov started to open the doors, the circuitry shorted out and... Incessantly. And our above was trying to open the doors, but I was crying and crying, hoping for a miracle. And then what happened? So you and your dad never made up? We didn't even talk. Our above went to space and never got back. Well, you could talk to him now using this bear. Uh-huh. But it's a one-way connection. We'll talk when he wants to. I'm fine with that. I guess the camera and microphone just broke when it fell down. We rested long enough. We have to go. <sighs> Lyra, hmm? there's another exit in the back. we are. Igor? Igor! I asked you not to run away, Igor. Lyra. What's wrong? Are they waiting for us? Mm. Come with me. <gasps> no, I guess it's just broke down. One more broken car. Give me your hand. Igor! Igor! 
Yagor! It's green. Dad told me it's okay to go. Wait, Yagor, don't run away! Yegor, please don't run away from me! Yegor! You told me that your dad could connect to anything to any device. What if now he's connected the traffic lights and he's showing us the way? Let's go check it out, okay? All right. Come on. You see? Follow me! You know, Mira, traffic lights were actually a good idea. According to my calculations, escorting Lyra to a safe place is the easiest way to convince you to leave the emergency station. Well, I'm convinced. Let's show them the way. Look, it's so cool! Mira, switch the horse on. There's a sign over there! Whoa! I'm here. Let's go. Wow, that's pretty cool. Eight, nine. I guess Arabov is very pleased with himself. Why do you keep calling him Arabov? Should I call him Petrov? Well, that's offensive. He's your dad, after all. What, are you his lawyer? Go. Mira, now turn the cones on. I don't know what is a lawyer, but your dad is really cool. Hold on, who do we have here? Turn it on. Oh, who is that? Arabov in the flesh. Yep. That's how I imagined him. Don't be afraid. Let's go. Okay, fine. You can prepare your escape capsule. Wait! Are we there? Flight Engineer Arabov. Capsule will be ready in four minutes. Well, my sweetheart. I'll see you soon. Mira, I'm ready. Turn it all off. Cool. Hurry up. I'm not staying here. No, it's okay. They won't, Yegor. Yegor, don't run away from me! Dismiss turning off. Mira, what is that? Analyze it. Detonation of a small tank on the transatlantic tanker in the Golden Horn Bay. Fireboats and rescue services that were extinguishing the tanker were destroyed by the explosion. Mira, analyze the probability of a second explosion at that location. Do it quick! Let's 
rush him to the makeshift hospital. It's gonna be fine, little buddy. There you go. <laughs> Take this baby, will you? Please, help him. It's urgent. You'll help, help everyone. You'll just have please. to wait, please. But he needs help now. Yeah, control center on the line. Valera, what's going on? Why are you still at the station? There was a situation, sir, an explosion near the camp. One of the tanks happened to have been detonated. I analyzed it, and if the others go off, it'll blow away half the city. It's not our business. It's firemen's issues. Firemen, all right? Not astronauts. There's no goddamn firemen, all right? They're all killed in the explosion. Don't send any more firemen to help out. Yes, they will. It's just they might. They could be late. Thing is, my daughter's there. Right there. Tell me, please, Alex Lovovich. Could you help her? Right now? Well, I can. How? I don't know yet. But I'll figure it out. Valera, I understand. Don't approve it. I do understand. Thanks a lot, Alex Vovovich. Mira, over and out. Detailed analysis of the burning vessel. When will it explode? Starting data gathering. I remind you that in 23 minutes, 37 seconds, our station will enter the atmosphere. <clears throat> Mira! Connect me with Lyra ASAP. Find any device near her. More helicopters. We just have to wait. <clears throat> How are you feeling? I'm fine. Huh. I thought there was no connection. Hello? Give Lyra the phone. Who are you? Just give Lyra the phone. Well, sir, you're actually calling my phone. <sighs> the camera up there. Okay, so, Terentev Mikhail Vasilievich, 14-year-old boarding school graduate, charged with misdemeanor. Please pass the phone. Go to Lyra. Are you some kind of cop? No, Misha, I'm an astronaut. I can see everything from up here. Is that your dad? Yeah. Dad, I'm sorry, I've... You need to leave. Right now. What? What about the helicopter? There will be no helicopter. Do you see the tanker? There was an explosion. A small tank detonated. There's a fire in the bilges. If the fire gets to the main tanks... Half the city will be entirely blown off. Yeah, got it. Okay, I'll, I'll go warn people. And you tell me... Hold on, Lyra, just stop. Please, listen to me. I've considered everything. The rescuers are too far, they won't make it. And people won't believe you. Even if they will, they'll panic. You lose precious time. Actually, such vessels have firefighting technology. I enrolled at Naval Academy. Arabov, 
You can connect to anything. Can't you connect to that tanker system? Lyra, it's not possible. I've tried. It's tooled styled. There's no remote control. Do you understand? It has to be controlled manually, but there's no people. Lyra, there's only one option. Run, and hide as far away as you can. Lyra will determine a route to the nearest bunker. It's safe there. I'll lead you. You want us... to run and hide as far away as we can? So, to do exactly what you did back then? Lyra. Let's discuss it later. Please. You said the rescuers won't be there in time, right? Well, we're here. We're so close, I mean. I think I think we could just go to that tanker and um we could activate this system ourselves, right, Misha? Yeah. Mm-hmm. What? Lara, are you insane? Lara! Come on, we need your help. So you want my help to go to that tanker and extinguish it yourself? Did I get it right? So, if I get it right, Arbov, I can't count on your help. You're abandoning me again. Lara, what are you talking about, huh? You can't even look at a burning match, but still you want to run through the blazing tanker? Who do you think you are? A superhero? No, I'm not a superhero. I'm a girl with special needs, remember? Hey, hey, what's wrong with you? It was a present. From my grandma. Lyra. Lyra! Damn! How do we get to the tanker? I thought it was a joke. You're not serious. said it's a slight concussion. He'll be fine. Be careful, it's hot. Okay. Hello? Savannah, I'm sorry. I promised you I would help Lyra, but... I... What? Where is she? a little bit. Well, if you need to get some food, don't starve yourself. Look around and I'm sure you'll find some astronaut breakfast. I believe in you. I do. The only one who can save our daughter now.
Nova, stop shivering. Makes the boat shake. Are you that cold? No, I'm not. Do you want to row? It's a joke. You'll get warm on the tanker. Terentiev, are you human or not? Why are you making these stupid jokes? Just a habit. Ugh. How long have you had such a bad habit? Since I was 13. That's when I played with Firecracker. What a joke it was. Wow! I've been fooling around ever since. I saw your bones when you were putting Jaeger on that chopper. Are you ashamed of them? Oh no, I'm proud of them. Why not? I would be. Really? Would you be proud of such ugliness? I don't see any ugliness in that. I only see a young person who faced the pain, coped with it, and remained a human. So... Yes, I would be proud. Next. What do you mean? I thought you applied to naval school. I did, but I failed. What? Calm down. We'll figure it out. Let's go, Lyra. But... We have to follow the signs. They usually mark everything on the vessels. Don't look. Come on. Find a plan of action. You sit there with the toy. It's, it's not a toy. Yeah, right. It's not a toy. Sure, it's, it's not. It's a baby monitor. It's how Arbob and I communicate. It's an amazing baby monitor. It's just broken. Huh? It's broken. Let me take a look. Let me take a look. Come on. to contact Lyra is available. What's that? Yeah, contact Lyra. Quick. All right, Lyra. Misha, where is she? I'm up. I, I disobeyed you again. We'll talk about it later. We've got bigger problems. Let me see. So there's fire all over your level. You won't go through. You need to get to the engine room. That's the only way. Look for a trapdoor and get down there quickly. Come on. 
Okay, we need to find a trapdoor. Here it is. No, that's not it. Look for another one. Where? Here it is. Come on, come on, come on. That's the one. Get down quickly. Your dad is so cool. What a wild family. That's our hermetic door. Close it. Get out of here. There's a helm. Seal the airlock. Come on, steer it. Hurry. Steer it faster. Come on, you're almost there. Faster. Oh, come on. Calm down. It's okay. On, you're almost there. It's almost there. Good job. You did it. How are you? Okay. Move the engine along. There's a way out. Get down! Come on, Lyra. Damn it! Come on, Lyra. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Don't give up. Just run. Faster. Come on. Turn left. Go up the stairs. Come on. Around the stairs. Go up the stairs. Come on. Higher. Stairs. Okay. Get in there. Hold on. Let me do it. Great. You made it. Look for a switchboard. I hope it's that simple. Where's that? It doesn't work. Damn. The power is off. You'll have to do it manually then. There's a manual control chamber. Go there now. Stay here. I'll be back. Hold on. Check the door first. Lyra! Lyra! Lyra, sweetie, where are you? Lyra! Misha! 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 Sweetheart, I'll figure it out. Lyra. Lyra, over. Mira, what's wrong? Contact with the batteries in the laboratory compartment has been lost. No, not now. Hibernation regime. Come on, I need more time, Mira. Turn off everything you can. Turn off all the life support systems. Just get the connection back. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Not enough power. Sweetheart, I need you to contact Lyra now, do you understand? I have to, otherwise it's all pointless. Don't do this to me now! Reconnection is possible only when the search system is connected to the last active energy Hold source. Hold on, what energy source are you talking about? I can make use of the voice assistant's central storage unit. Then do it, Mira, hurry up! Flight Engineer Arabov, unlike humans, I'm not able to turn myself off. You'll have to execute this action manually. Do you know why we called you, Mira? My full name is Voice Assistant of the Orbital Station, Mir A. Crew. Mira is a binary star. One is massive and powerful. The other small, but so bright. The small one feeds the big one. And the big one protects the small one. Their existence would be pointless without each other. That's a beautiful metaphor. I wonder who came up with it. Hmm? It was a rhetorical question. <laughs> the communication channel is open. Goodbye, Flight Engineer Arabov. 
Goodbye, Mira. Yes, I did. I did because I I shouldn't have let you go in in the first Dad, place. Please. Dad, please. stop. Please, Dad, stop. I shouldn't have touched them. I shouldn't have left them alone. Dad. I couldn't have been. Dad. I couldn't. I hope you know that. Please forgive me. I didn't feel guilty. It's not your fault. There's nothing to forgive. There's absolutely nothing to forgive. It's, it's just that I've been missing you so much. I've been missing you, Dad. I've been missing you too. So very much. I've been missing you every day. So have I. Come on, sweetheart. Come on, you have to live. So just get up and do it. You can handle it. No, I won't do it. I can't, Dad. It's all on fire. Look up. Can you see that box? Look. There's a fireproof suit in it. Put it on. I'll be here with you. Okay, Dad, I'll put it on.
tough kid. He'll soon be playing soccer. con la secuencia de acción más larga que yo he visto. 10 minutos ininterrumpidos de pura acción, desastre y catástrofe como ninguna otra. Mira 2022 o 12 horas para el fin del mundo. Y como no podía ser de otra forma, está en mi canal completa, en español latino y con calidad de 2K. O sea, se ve increíble. Mira 2022 es una película que no debes perderte. Si aún estás aquí, significa que la película te gustó y por lo mismo no hay mucho que agregar. Pero yo quería decirte que esta película me hizo reconsiderar los puntos que tomaba en cuenta al momento de elegir ver una película. Por ejemplo, cuando iba a ver una película, yo buscaba primero el actor, el director, la casa productora y el país de origen. Porque entendía que la película que eran fuera de Estados Unidos no, no tenía, tenía la calidad, la calidad para suficiente que equivocado estaba. Mira 2022 y la película Triple R hicieron que yo reconsiderara la forma de ver la película o que no la juzgara simplemente por su país de origen. Porque esta película tiene un buen guión, buena actuación, buena dirección y un excelente argumento. Nada que envidiarle a una película de Hollywood, por lo menos desde mi punto de vista. Si te gusta nuestro contenido, por favor suscríbete a mi canal, dale like, comenta y comparte para seguir trayendo este video como este. No olvides pasar a mi canal a disfrutar de esta increíble película Mira 2022 o 12 horas para el fin del mundo en español latino, la mejor película de desastre y catástrofe de 2022 o la que yo he visto de este género. Muchísimas gracias por estar en mi canal.